Hello, sports fan. This is Stephen Hill for Sports Choice Plus. I'm bringing you a very special breakdown. I'm going to be covering the Jacksonville Jaguars taking on the Cincinnati Bengals. Before I get right into that, I want to make sure you're subscribed to the YouTube channel so you can get all the updates each and every time we have breakdowns here at Sports Choice Plus. Without further ado, we're going to get right into the action. Looking at this game, this is going to be the Thursday night game of the week for uh, this week, and you're looking exactly at both these teams coming in. A loss to the Arizona Cardinals really showed us a lot about the Jacksonville Jaguars. Looking at this team top to bottom, I, I expected a lot more out of this team. They have a lot of talent at different skills, positions, and you're looking at the quarterback position being one of them that you think, man, they got a real good piece of talent with Trevor Lawrence, but it's not manufacturing into anything pretty good at the moment. Urban Meyer is being outcoached in almost every single game. It's not even close. Everything from offense, defense, special teams, the Jaguars are being outpaced, outplayed, and out-schemed. When you're looking on the other side of this ball, you're looking at uh, a, a defense that literally has pieces that can make a difference, but they're out of place. It seems like on every single play that they get beat, somebody's out of place. I can't put my finger on it, but it may be youth. It may just be that they're young and they need to take their lumps. But right now, it's looking bad for Jacksonville. And Urban Meyer, it's a, if you thought you had pressure at the University of Florida or pressure at Ohio State, you're not going to have four or five years to get this job done. You're going to have one year or two, and then you're going to be out the door if you don't get this thing together. But the Cincinnati Bengals are surprising me. They have a small triplet trio starting to, starting to rear its head. When you look at Jamar Chase, what drops? What drops were we referring to? You know, the preseason when he was dropping the ball everywhere, he's not dropping the ball anymore. He's catching those touchdowns. If you watched yesterday, Joe Burrow and 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 Jamar Chase were literally lighting up the Steelers secondary. I know they didn't have Watt, but it's different. I think that the Steelers are playing a finesse style of football now. They're not the run run powered Steelers that they used to be. It's just finesse offense for them. And I think that leads to defense as well. The Steelers are missing an enforcer. Um, and, and what? And when you're when you're missing your enforcer, you don't play up to that uh, 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 formidable level sometimes. And I think that in that game, you know, Cincinnati took advantage of it, and they was like, "Oh, no, what? No problem." They just steamrolled the Steelers. Big Ben has got to get rid of the ball because you saw a lot of what he was doing yesterday was getting him killed. Cincinnati Bengals took big advantage of that. They literally did what they had to do to, to get it done. When you're looking at this game here, the Cincinnati Bengals have the, the mix in, the Joe Burrow, Jamar Chase. They have that triplet trio. And I think that these guys can get it together and start putting together solid football games. It's going to be hard for teams to beat them. If that defense pulls up for the Bengals, as I know they can, like they did yesterday, they can do big things. And against the Jacksonville Jaguars, they have the clear-cut advantage, and I'm picking them to win this one. I think the Bengals are special. I think that with Joe Burrow getting back healthy, Jamar Chase really adding that pop and mix of being in the mix on the ground, they have everything it takes to beat this Jacksonville Jaguars team. I'm not looking for any surprises, but I'm looking for the Jacksonville Jaguars to show us uh, uh, some type of fight. I know the Bengals are going to bring the thunder, and I think that the Bengals are going to win this game. All you Bengals fans, get in the comment section. All you Jaguars fans, get in the comment section and tell me what you think about the game's predictions. And as always, we thank you so very much. We'll see you on the next video, and make sure you like, share, and subscribe. All right.